Tuesday. Again, welcome to episode two of Kindergarten 2. So last episode, we went ahead and did a tale of two janitors where we helped out the old janitor kill the new janitor and the new hall monitor, and we snatched the old janitor's tool belt. We also went ahead and got two new outfits. We got Stevie's head and body, which is called uptight cut and strict sash. And we also got Bob's head, which is kind cleaner and Bob's body, which is jolly jumper. Today, we're gonna wear Stevie's head and Bob's body. Achievement unlocked, what to wear. Nice. For today's mission, we are going to be doing flowers for Diana. Start the mission by talking to Dr. Danner. So without further ado, let's head on to kindergarten. Hey, Dr. Danner. Ah, one of the new specimens. Not that we'll be seeing much of each other. Why not? I don't let below average students into my classroom for morning time. I'm not below average. Oh, really? Then perhaps you'd be willing to prove it. How so? Here's the deal. If you can bring me five different types of flowers, I'll let you into my morning time class. Why do you want flowers? Plants have a wonderful biology to them. So many possibilities for medicine and energy and poisons and neurotoxins and monster enhancing. Ahem. <clears throat> Just get the flowers, okay? Fine. Excellent. Don't disappoint me. If you don't complete the collection, it would be better if you don't show up in my science class at all. Why is that? Because if you don't get all of those samples, I'll switch today's lesson from plants to something that involves a nasty dissection. Got it? Got it. Good. Now go get my flowers. Where can I find them? Ugh. Your thought process is so simple. Females tend to like flowers. Maybe start there. I have a feeling I know where this is going. Any other ideas? One specimen grows in the garden by the handicap ramp. Another by the dumpster behind the school. Pretty sure Cindy has one flower. Handy camp ramp. Not sure how to get over there. I think I have to talk to Monty. And I know how to get to the dumpster behind the school. There's one in a vase in the teacher's lounge. And the rarest flower isn't even at the school. You have to get some love-struck loser to deliver it. Ha 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 ha. You'll never be allowed in my class. So what are you waiting for? Go. Go on your futile errand. And hopefully this is the last. We'll see each other today. We'll see about that. Oh. A word to the wise. You may want to have a chat with the hall monitors before the day gets started. They tend to give people trouble when collecting my flowers. Where are they? I saw them chatting inside at the top of the staircase. So you'll let me in to talk to them? Of course not. Only disabled students are allowed into the school early. And even if you snuck in, the lunch lady would stop you. I'll figure something out. Alright, looks like we're talking to Monty. He's the only one wheelchair bound. Hey, ugh, you looking to buy something? I need to get to the handicap ramp. I see. Well, maybe we can work something out. Like what? I'll tell Bob over there that you're pushing me up the ramp for $3. Sound good? Sure. Pleasure doing business with you. It always is, Monty. Hey, I need that kid I was just chatting with to push me up the ramp. Oh, alrighty then. Go on by. Bye, Bob. Alright, so we got one flower here. This is a blue flower. You take the flower. This is the whole nugget stuck through. It looks like this hole caved in. I don't want to touch any dirt. There's a sign with arrows on it here. They point up, left, up, right, up, right, left, up. Huh? Okay, up, left, up. You know what? I'm gonna take a picture of this. I'm cheating. You know what? Technology. Oh, it's one of these. All right, let's see. Up, and then left, up, right, up, right, left, and then up. Ooh. New monster bond unlocked. Legendary sword. Oh, and Monty's gone. Oh, never mind, he's right there. Uh-oh. What's this? No children are allowed in the halls before the bell rings. I'm sorry, I didn't know. Your apologies do not appease me. You will be punished. What's my punishment? The principal recommends study hall, but I recommend death. I'll take study hall. A wise decision, but your input does not weigh in my decision. So what's your decision? Death. I'd prefer if you didn't. New outfit unlocked. Gee, thanks. You died. Don't go inside unless the lunch lady has been removed. I wouldn't just leave a student trapped in a sewer. The fire department is on their way to get him out. Thanks, I'll let him know. Oh, that won't be necessary. I'll have my sister watch over him. Oh, Margaret! Huh? Behind you, sweetheart. Wait, that's her sister? Oh, how can I be of service? There's a boy trapped in the sewer grate. Go keep him company. Yes, principal, sister, dear. There, all taken care of. Okay, so now we got rid of her. I have to talk to the hall monitors now. There they are. Where all that stands between chaos and order. Do you understand? Yeah, bro, I get it. It's hall monitoring. It's not that big a deal. Not that big a deal. If you're not going to take this serious... <gasps> Student, in the halls, before the bell. Study hall, study hall. Jeez, you really are a little spaz, aren't you? This is your chance to prove yourself, rookie. Take this kid to the principal's office. Fine, I'll take care of it. Go monitor downstairs or something. 
Look, man, I don't really care that you're up here. That little dweeb can fall down those stairs for all I care. He seems a little uptight. No kidding. Just to stick it to the little jerk, why don't you take this? It's good through morning time. He can't do much to you while you're carrying it. Thanks. New outfit unlocked. Sweet. Now let's get you back outside. Come on, dude. Don't come back in or Stevie will totally flip. Okay. Oh, never mind. Just head on down to class. Get a move on. Go to class. What did he give me? A pass? Okay, kids. Teacher has a headache, so we're going to be very quiet. Okay. Hey, you can't leave. I'm responsible for you little monsters. I have a hall pass. I didn't give you a... You know what? Go ahead. I don't think a jury would convict me over that. I kind of forgot where all the flowers were. So I'm kind of just walking around everywhere and hoping that I find one. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Let me restart from the schoolyard. Females tend to like flowers. Let's talk to other girls. Let's start with Carla. Do you have any flowers? Flowers? <laughs> no. Looking to brown nose, Dr. Danner, huh? Come see me at lunch. You're gonna want my help. Do you have any flowers? Of course I do. I have a pretty pink one, but you already know I have that reserved for my new boyfriend. Who's your new boyfriend? I haven't decided yet. I'm thinking about one of those rich kids over there. I'll have my mind made up by morning time. What about the flower? Wow, you're really caught up on this whole flower thing, aren't you? I'll tell you what. You help me get hitched for the day, and it's all yours. Deal. Good. See you during morning time. See you then. So I think I've started this pretty well. So now we have to talk to Cindy. Oh, good. I was hoping I would see you. Decided on a boy yet? Yep, the cute boy in the blue shirt and red tie. But he's too smart for this class. He's in the upstairs class. I want you to take this to him. What is it? It's a love letter. Now go give it to him. Okay, fine. I already know how to get upstairs. Nugget? <laughs> Nugget is present. No. Nugget is late. So you're getting study hall. Oh, dear God, what happened to your arm? Nugget had to chew it off in order to escape from the failed Nugget cave. Why did you... <sighs> Never mind. Do you want to go to the nurse? You're bleeding all over my new classroom. Nugget is quite durable. Nugget will survive. If you insist, go ahead and play or do whatever it is that you do. And Nugget takes the fidget spinner. Alright, now we go to the smart people class. And we talk to Felix. I have no interest in discussing trivial things with you. I have a love letter for you. Oh goodness, I'm flattered, but I must declare it's from Cindy. Relax. Uh, get your boy toys in a twist. Oh, that makes much more sense. You had me worried things were about to get awkward. Yeah, good thing it's not awkward. Let's see here. A partner would make me more appealing to potential investors. How awful is Cindy? She's not bad. Excellent. Then I will accept her request. We will dine together. Good. Here's for your trouble, messenger boy. Ta-ta. Uh, thanks. Oh, he gave me money. Say, I haven't seen you around here before. Why aren't you in this class? I'm working on that. A man of ambition. I like that. Dr. Danner loves his plants. Those red flowers are really hard to come by. How do I get them? I'd ask some of the adults. See if any of them are smitten with a new faculty member now that there's been additions to the administration here. Thanks for the tip. Alright, so let's go look for the adults. Ooh. You blushing. Oh gosh, I didn't see you there. This is the girls' bathroom. You're not supposed to be in here. You look a little red. Ah, oh, well, um, you see, I saw this beautiful woman. She had lovely brown hair, a beautiful purple dress, and huge... You mean Miss Applegate? Is that her name? Wow, Miss Applegate. I just wish I knew how to get her attention. Why not get her flowers? You think she would like that? Yeah, yeah, I'll get her flowers. Thanks for the tip, kid. No problem. If I leave now, I can be back in time to give them to her at recess. Ooh, good plan. Whoa there, little man. You shouldn't be in here. Sorry. I'm not gonna ask any questions. Just go to lunch. My word, she is a handful. What's wrong? She wants something vegan, but I don't know what the devil that means. Neither does she. Well, you have to help me find something she'll eat. This is all you're doing anyway. I'll figure something out. Good. Just remember to bring it to me, not her. We're trying to make me look good here. Got it. How the hell am I gonna find something vegan? Okay, why are you guarding this? No kids allowed in the teacher's lounge. Go finish your lunch, kid. I need to get in there. I don't care what you need. I'm not moving unless there is a monitoring emergency. A monitoring emergency? I deal with them on a daily basis. You never know when delinquency or tardiness will strike. Clara told me to talk to her at lunchtime, so let's talk to Clara. Hey, new kid. How are you liking the food? You mentioned needing your help. Oh yeah, you're still looking to score points for Dr. Danner, right? Well, there's one of those flowers in the teacher's lounge. How do I get in there? Stevie's pretty easy to lure away. All I'd have to do is leave without a pass. Are you willing to do that for me? Of course. For the right price. How much? Since I'll be getting study hall for this, it'll run you five bucks. Do we have a deal? No deal. Because I still have to find something vegan for Cindy. Hello, child. What would you like for lunch? Got anything vegan? Oh, 
Yes, I should have seen this coming. You new students are so picky. I can prepare something in the back, but the janitor looks to still be mopping in the area. So you won't get it for me? Patience, child. You wouldn't want me to have a nasty fall. I wouldn't. So, we will wait for the janitor to finish his work. I will make the food then. Well, since she's doing that, might as well do the thing for Carlo now. Excellent. I'll give him the run around for the rest of lunch. Good luck, kid. Thanks. Hey, Stevie. What? Um, oh. Hello, Carlo. Can I get a pass for the bathroom? No, you can't. You already used yours today. Well, then, it looks like I'll just have to go outside then. Hey, come back. It's not recess time yet. And he leaves. She goes to do that. Working pretty smoothly. Pretty smoothly. Okay. Let's go in here. And, oh no. Well, 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 look who it is. Seems that Stevie is slipping in his duties. How's my flower collection coming along? Have you found any yet? I've found one. Oh, really? That's more than I expected. I suppose you are in here to collect the flower in the vase over there. Yep. So be it. Make it quick and get out. I have to check on something outside. And I'll be damned if I let a child stay in the teacher's lounge unsupervised. Got it. This vase has a yellow flower in it. Take the flower. All right, I've entertained your presence long enough. Get out. Okay, sheesh. And you look like you're done. You have returned for your picky food? I have. There you are, child. Please enjoy your rabbit food. Thanks. Bye, Ozzy. All right, now we give it to Felix. Please tell me you found something she'll eat. She's becoming insufferable. Here you go. Brilliant. Excellent work, Aaron Boy. No problem. Here you are, darling. A nice vegan meal for you. Aw, thanks, sweetie. You're the best. Now you just need to do one more thing for me at recess and we'll be official. Can't wait, honeysuckle. Jesus, leave before they start making out. The bell has rung. Be gone from my cafeteria. Anyone who has disobeyed our lovely principal today shall report to study hall. All others may go play at recess. Go to recess. That's why I never saw recess the first time around. Because I had study hall. Thank goodness you're here. She is being absolutely wicked. What now? She is insisting that I do something horrible to one of the other girls, but I'm not much for getting my hands dirty. So you want me to do it? Of course. Cindy already told me that you want a flower for Dr. Danner. It's as good as yours if you can destroy Penny's self-esteem. How do I do that? She has quite the eye for contraband. I say you take this and plant it by the tree with the beehive. What is this? I'm not really sure. All I know is that it was in a safe in our summer home. Father probably doesn't want it found. If I put it by the tree? Yes. I'll let her know it's there. When she's under the tree, shake it until the hive falls. The bee will sting her and she'll look awful, just like Cindy wants. This tree is quite large. It is a beehive hanging precariously from a branch. Plant the contraband. Good day, Penny. Hello, Felix. It is a good day, isn't it? The sun is shining and the- Yes, yes, cut the chit chat. I heard a nasty rumor that one of those nasty new children has hidden some contraband behind the big tree. Oh no, I'll look for it right away. Oh my, there certainly is some contraband around here. I just need to find it. Yeah, 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 shake the tree. Ow, oh, it hurts, help me, help me. Mommy, please. Bloody good show. Cindy will be quite pleased. I'm happy you're happy. Music to my ears. Those bees did a great job on that awful girl's face. How do you sleep at night? I'd probably sleep better if I could record that and listen to it on repeat. Can I have the flower now? Of course. A deal's a deal. Thanks for hooking me up with this walking gold mine. I'm sure we'll be very happy together. Ay yeah, yeah. you deserve each other. Oh, would you look at that? The little snitch didn't take the contraband. Well, I wouldn't mind if you wanted to keep it. Perhaps you could find another use for it. Like what? Well, I've seen father's associates sell large qualities. Perhaps there's a buyer nearby. Yeah, sure. Um, Miss Applegate? Huh? Oh, it's you, the new janitor. What do you want? These... <laughs> these are for you. You got me flowers? Why, that's the sweetest thing anyone's ever done for me that didn't involve pills. Come with me. But what about the flowers? Leave them! I'll just be taking that. This is the bouquet of flowers Bob got for Miss Applegate. It is made up of red flowers. I'll take one of those. And we're gonna go up here. And we're gonna take that. Take the flower. And bada bing bada boom, we have all five flowers. What did you want to sell? This stuff. <laughs> Where did you get that? <laughs> oh jeez kid, whatever you're doing, you're in way over your head. Do you want it or not? Yeah, yeah, sure. How's five bucks sound? It's worth more than that, according to Felix. I know, I just didn't know that you knew that. Fine, I'll throw in a Monstermon card on top of the five dollars. New Monstermon card unlocked, literally grass. I don't need anything else. That's the bell. Let's go all back inside. No stalling. Anyone who wants to pay the lab fee can go to the science classroom. Everyone else, meet in the gym. Let's go to science. Welcome to the science class. Today's lesson will be about plants. Please observe the common plant in front of you. Notice how it is neither carnivorous or poisonous because the PTA is a bunch of cowards. Feel free to take a sample and look at it under one of the microscopes. This one won't do much, but it could if Ozzy's mom wasn't such a wimp. Ah, I almost forgot. 
One of you was supposed to get me flower samples today. Did you manage to get them all? Yup. You did? Well, that is most impressive. I didn't think a lowly student such as yourself could manage it. So do I get an A? We'll see. I'll be right back. What the hell is that? The PTA said you can't do stuff like this anymore. Oh, all of you shut up. The new student has actually managed to get all of the specimens needed to allow Diana to grow and there's no way the PTA will stop me. Got it, Ozzy? Got it. Now we're going to be feeding her the flowers in a very particular order. Um, where did I leave those notes? I left them downstairs. I'll be back momentarily. Feel free to observe the boring plant while I run out and grab them. How did you discover the order? What? Oh, it just came to me while I was gazing around the room. I'll be back with it shortly. Don't touch anything. Uh, let's see. We have blue, yellow, purple, red, and green. Blue, yellow, purple, but then purple, red, green. It would be blue, yellow, purple, red, green. Let's try that. Okay, so we start with blue. Uh, the yellow. Purple. Red. And then the last one is green. I found my notes. We can now begin my word. She's absolutely radiant. Did you? Did you actually feed her the flowers in the right order? I guess so. I'm stunned. I never would have expected such ability from a simpleton such as yourself. I'm not a simpleton. Thank you very much. New monster mon card unlocked. Monsters fly trap. I suppose you have earned an A plus for the day. Hell yeah. You are welcome to join my advanced class for a morning time tomorrow. You're also welcome to have the silly card from that game you play. I'm touched. Well, there's the bell. I'll be seeing you tomorrow for morning time. I guess you will. Death counter is only at one compared to last time where I was at four. Day complete. Achievement unlocked, flowers for Diana. New item unlocked, an A+. New clothing unlocked, we got Cook's Apron and Monitor's Sash. We'll be wearing those next episode. And we got three new Monster Mon cards. Legendary Sword, Literally Grass, and Monstrous Flytrap. Tuesday, again times two. Literally Grass, it's just grass. Mow it regularly. Legendary Sword. It deals extra damage when wielded by someone who has never been hurt in their entire life. Monstrous Flytrap. The only known species of plant to actually hunt down its prey. So that is where we're going to end it for Kindergarten 2, Episode 2. If you enjoyed, consider leaving a like on the video and consider subscribing. I would super appreciate it. Next episode, we are going to be going ahead and doing the Hitman's Bodyguard. Start the mission by talking to Felix and then Ted. But yeah, I'll see you guys next time.